welcome everyone to the best of the best in the nation of shows with Mr. Smooth himself, Ian Webster and his dancers. In case it slip you, or perhaps you took it for granted, or maybe you never intended to make it an issue. Well, let me take the bull by the horns now, this subject mashing me horns now. Like we becoming a nation of shows. And if you doubt me, look back at some previous newspapers from January. Right up the day before yesterday oh, Let me refresh your memory If you want me to So in no particular order Here are a few Watch it We had Beres, Haman and Maxi We had Jarul and Ashanti We had The big and the beautiful and cargo man We had Mother and daughter pageant We had the Richard Stouting talent. We had Congo line with Big Irie and Glenn Washington. The vagina monologue made a statement. Spectacular brought in their calypso tent. And vintage reggae had we on we toes. But as an objective person, Give me your honest opinion, are we now becoming a nation of shows? Oh. Check it, check it. The Jazz Festival started the trend bright and early, but ended in controversy and bubble bacchanal. Because foreign artists were applauded, locals felt unappreciated. Due to statements carried in the press. Yes, Dong in St. Lucy shows of a whole different nature. Had parents skinny to hear all their daughters expose themselves. But apart from all that nudity, which was so obscene, all of the rest of the show that we had was clean. We had the young Warwick and the Divas. We had a festival of choirs. We had Laugh It Off and Miss Bikini International. Barbados Pan Festival, Trevor Eastman show as usual. We had ice skating and Mr. and Miss in Michael. The NCF did not get left out, they do. No, they had their banks calvacate, free shows too. Competition and concerts coming through, we know. Well, this whole situation. Will give anyone the impression that we now becoming a nation of shows. Oh. Die, 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 die. Listen, someone would tell me to ease the stress and frustration. The need for a doctor's prescription is unnecessary. When a good show could serve the same purpose, live on stage or at the Olympus, recreation could well be the cure. I will not argue 
with that probable conclusion. But I will tell you what I have noticed here recently. Look, politicians jump out the starting locks as we gun let go and down the road. Them gone and put on them show. Cause look, we had Billy Pelton straight at Patrick. Master Paul Williams rubbed the wicket. We had Mia putting all she weight on the Rasta man. Lacey Wallace Stevenson bowling. Half a con play Owen spinning. Young Arthur was far too slow for old boy Kelman. The mighty Gabby as well joining the show. Oh, drop out the team and cross over the floor. Kids side put up and come out to share some blows. Well, I hope you see the reason. I have been asking the question, are we now becoming a nation of show? Oh. Thank you.